So I ran around and I looted a bunch of dudes. Yay. Their corpses were full of delicious bullets. Rich in iron. Well, yeah. There's a bunch of iron in their blood, so... That was the stupidest scene in X-Men 2. <laughs> Doesn't work that way either. That much no. iron in his blood would have killed him. <laughs> eh, let's go back and grab that GPS while I still remember where it is. Was it X-Men 3 that had all the silliness with the juggernaut in it? Yes. Yeah. No. Yes. Yeah. I'm the juggernaut, bitch! Chasing after Juno. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't believe you when you say, Kalon, that those X-Men movies actually got good, because I watched the first three, <laughs> and I present those as evidence to the contrary, and I believe I present Listen, a strong at, case. Once, once you get to... Uh, once you get to first class, it, they got pretty good. First one was so fucking boring. Yeah, the first one was pretty boring. Second one was all right. The only thing I remember with the third one is British football player chasing <laughs> after Juno. Lee <laughs> Jones. Anyway, there's exploding barrels now, and usually, what I would do in this area was would. Uh, sneak around, wait for them to uh, come around and choke them one at a time, but this is much more exciting. It's way more fun to watch. There's a gas pipeline up there that's still pumping gas. Mm-hmm. Where is all this stuff coming from? Underground, I think. Alright, I buy that. Hey! This guy is trying to spooky me, but nope. Spooky you. Yes, he's trying to spooky me. Machete does not win against gun, idiot. No, it doesn't, especially when you just r run right for them instead of zigzagging. Don't, don't you fucking serpentine. <laughs> it's bullshit. At least, like, throw it or something. You might nick her hand. You might have a fighting chance, then. Hmm, you can't do anything in this room except, for some reason, pump it full of gas. Yeah! This is safe. There's no way to run, outsider. So, did I just miss something, or is there a reason why we're pumping this place full of gas? No, you didn't miss anything. Laura just decided it was a good idea to pump it full of gas. <sighs> also, the gas is highly flammable, so, uh... With all these sparks going on, and it's just fine. Boom! Poor bastard. <laughs> Anyway, is there anything we get a new toy. Yeah, oh, there it is. There's plenty left of them. I got your gun. It's a nice gun. Machine now gun. I have a machine <laughs> gun. Ho ho ho. Please. Eh, nah. You're a jerk. I don't like. Wow. Any and also, uh, oh well. I accidentally started listening to this, so I was like, eh. Oh, uh, good. We've stumbled upon a Nazi <laughs> secret science lab. <laughs> Nothing could possibly have made this worse except for this. I think it's actually Japanese secret super science lab. There were probably Nazis involved. Oh, undoubtedly. ...anticipated and layered with many centuries of history. The task of identifying the source of the storms will be long and arduous. But if we succeed in our mission here, our victory in this war will be certain. Anyway, so either way, even if you leave him alive or dead, the ambush up ahead still happens. So I always kill him, and basically she just goes rotten hell, you bastard, after you shoot him. Wow. Yeah. Er, one. Two. Buckle my shoe. <laughs> oh, fucking machine gun, that's a problem. Pistol, no, it's fine. Oh god, all our plans! We didn't expect her to have a gun! No, we knew she had a pistol, it's like a machine gun specifically. Shit, we just got like knives, Larry had a bow, he lit his arrows on fire, we thought this was gonna work! <laughs> I thought that cover was destructible, but it is not. Unfortunately. This is not well thought out. For some reason, they always 
give you the destructible cover, but never the enemies. Aww. Hmm. You're a murder machine, it's in fairness. Well, okay, yes. You, you lost her, she's standing right in the open <laughs> in the searchlights. I don't know how I got a headshot on that guy, considering I shot him in the chest, but I'm not going to complain about an extra five experience. He was torso lad, and that was a prosthetic to hide his shame. <laughs> really? You did him a favor. His existence was nothing but pain and sorrow. Eh, grab this GPS while I still remember it's there. I guess we'll get all the collectibles. Uh. Yeah. Father Matthias will set us free. Fear the demons! Demons are to be feared, yes. Fear the demons sounds like some sort of death metal uh, I think that was an Iron Maiden album. Hmm. Oh, it's one of these guys again. <laughs> Good plan, idiot. <laughs> Ooga go I'm dead. Oh, right, she has a gun. Uh huh. I hmm. probably should have been paying attention during the past five minutes. Oh, well. Wah, wah. Better luck next time. What's this? Do oh. Whoops. <laughs> Good work. Shit, I broke it. Uh, did anyone see me? Now I can't just walk away. Okay. Alex, 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 it was totally broken when I got here and I didn't do anything. Yeah. The console's a wreck. Damn it. You broke it, didn't you? <laughs> no, no, I swear. What? No, you don't go to Radio Shack for this kind of shit. <laughs> uh, hi, do you have World War II era levers? <laughs> yeah, well... well I mean, you probably never went there in the first place. Radio Shack used to have uh, electronic parts, but mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's why they were called Radio Shack because it was a place you actually went to buy radios. This was back when radio was high technology. Mm hmm. Big old fucking arrows. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. Whoops. Uh. <laughs> Careful right. the steam pipes. Careful the steam pipes. Uh, oh, there goes my back. <laughs> you are being cooked alive. Yeah, you're dead. <laughs> no, no, I'm totally uh, fine. It's only just extremely hot wa water that. Stop touching just them! Tear <laughs> my skin off. Uh. I'm fine. Oh, yeah, no, great, kick them. No, that, that's actually a vent. It would still be an extremely hot vent. Great. But it's gr no, it's good, we're outside in the snow now, completely Wait, exposed. Yeah. She, at least she remarks that this is kind of fucking weird. Hmm, it's almost like we can transition between areas. Hmm... Oh good, someone left a fire here. Yeah, we can level up at our fire. Check the pot, maybe there's stew. Oh, <gasps> stew, yes! Stew's great. More ammo. I need to kill more things. You have upgraded Laura's butt. <laughs> <laughs> now to start upgrading the pistol. Uh, more damage. We need to kill things faster. And nope, can't do anything else because I don't have enough. Wait. Scrap. You want to be upgraded to that machine gun with just duct tape. <laughs> <laughs> For better gripping. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what that upgrade is. Oh no! Come on, we're getting off the cliff! Later, shit lord! The jerk. Damn, how many are there? Uh, I see three. There's, there's like 12 guys here, total. Oh, and unlike Uncharted, which is, for some reason, what everybody likes to compare this to a lot, you cannot 
blind fire, which was the best thing to do in Uncharted because blind firing was super fun. You can move around and shoot dudes, but in here you can't. If you're not aiming, then you're not firing. See that guy. That guy's problem was he froze up. He got right up to you, and then he's just like, "Oh shit, what do I do? Um, <laughs> uh, 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 swing? No, oh, shit, I'm dead." I then ex actually expect to get this far. I keep trying to shoot this guy <laughs> in the head, but it's not working. Thanks for announcing. All your <laughs> friends are dead, idiot. He ran away. I have. Uh, also, I seriously don't know where he went to. Are those lobster He's... traps? They uh, might be. No. But yes, that man disappeared into the ether, or he disappeared right there. That might be the same guy. Got it. I do like that they communicate. What the hell are you made of? <laughs> <laughs> Laura is a freight train. <laughs> Also, guys are worth 20 experience now for some reason. I think um, it's if you shoot them in the head. No, they're... Oh, okay. Why don't you shoot them in the trunk a bunch? See, that guy only gave 10, but the guy you shot in the head gave 20. Hmm, well, gave me 25. Maybe it was because I killed two guys really quickly, I don't know. Come on! Jeez, I am not good at games. <laughs> and yet you're LPing. Well, I'm LPing this game more for the spectacle than anything. Also, well, later, shit lords. Man, Lord's is really not having a good time with this. <laughs> she can look like a porcupine pulling arrows out. No, no, no. See, it's her luck. And when her luck gets run out... That was a really stupid explanation in fucking F games. No, that was specifically in Uncharted. It was Drake's luck. No, that's what people said about fucking Fred. Also, don't read Fred's. Yeah, you idiots, when he was Fred, don't read the Fred. I think that was actually a, the, the developer's um, explanation was that, hey, Drake's just really lucky at not getting shot, but eventually his luck runs out. Drake is fortune from... From Metal Gear Solid 2. <laughs> so, that means that, um... Uh, it means that, uh, Ocelot has actually snuck a big electric magnet on us. Oh. <laughs> but for some reason, we also can control bullets regularly if we concentrate really hard. Mm hmm. Later. <laughs> That's a good plan. <laughs> it was a great plan. I Let's loved put it. put myself directly in the open and draw attention to myself by screaming. <laughs> <laughs> He's still alive, though. He only fell, like, seven feet. Well, he took a bullet to the face, too. I think that might... Oh, he gave <laughs> no. you his machete. How nice of him. <laughs> <laughs> Later. Oh, he shot him in the dick. <laughs> Should still count as a headshot. <laughs> 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 She's killing all of you, you morons. Yeah. Maybe if you stop running into the open and screaming, that would stop happening. I'm reloading! Out in the open! <gasps> uh oh. Out of the way! She's This is fun, Charlie, because now here's Shield Guy. <laughs> Yes, and what you have to do is because Shield Guy only has a machete for some reason, you let him attack you, then you dodge, and then you shoot him a shitload. He only saved up enough box tops to get the shield. He has to save up enough to get the gun. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, he has to eat, like, a bunch more boxes of Cocoa Puffs to get the gun. <laughs> oh, shit. I mean, he could just tear the tops off the boxes, but that would be wasteful. He doesn't believe in that. He's gonna eat those Cocoa Puffs. Anyway, you can find r random upgrade parts either on vil on enemies or in salvage boxes. Like, you usually get a bow part around here all the time. It's just that I thought it was in a specific salvage box. You know, instead of picking up bow parts, you can just pick up the perfectly good bows that all the enemies have, and they are better than yours. <laughs> Yeah, usually that bow part is in that salvage box that I broke right there. I know the bad and yours, but theirs aren't made out of a bundle of sticks. 
No, no, see, mine has character. <sighs> oh, you missed the little thing back there. On the wall, there it is. Oh. Um, I actually don't think you can destroy those, but in the previous area, yes, there was a, um... A collectible, quote unquote, where you could burn flags of the cultists' uh, symbol. It's a perfectly good office chair. Yeah. <laughs> Clean it up a little bit. It's like 1940s technology. It'll last forever. Yeah. Get it reupholstered. Be fine. Time to upgrade machine gun, I think? Yes. Okay. Oh, I don't get the tape one. Damn it. That's going to be the next upgrade I get, is yeah, the one that says tape. tape. <laughs> that is a big damn rat. Good lord. I think it might be a gopher or something. Capybara. <laughs> it's got a big long tail. That's a rat. Holy shit, look how tall this thing is. God yeah, damn. do it. We're going to do it. Whoa. Holy shit, Laura. <laughs> Laura fucking hauls ass. Okay. So, I really like this set piece. It has some pretty good music associated with it, and even though there's no real danger in this particular part, I still think it's one of my favorite parts of the game. Just look at all those wow. dudes you murdered. Um, okay. Well, oh, shit. Ah, well. But look, a rope, a convenient rope that we can use to go down later. But, uh, we still gotta climb to the top, so... That'd be really unpleasant to climb if it was actually snowing. Yeah, it'd be yes, super it cold. And there's birds living up here? God damn. That's not actually snow. That's just concentrated bird shit. <laughs> <laughs> Falling from the clouds. There's a lot of birds. Yeah, it's not a cloud. It's just birds. <laughs> a lot of birds. And we are still not fucking done climbing. By the way, you are in control anytime Laura is climbing. Yeah, I know what happens here. Then you get to the top and you dive into a conveniently placed hay bale. <laughs> well, sometimes in four, sometimes it's a pile of, like, um, palm fronds for some reason. Because hmm. they don't have hay in the islands. Yeah. <sighs> that is uncharted music. That really is, but... Man, in real life, this would fucking terrify me because I do not like ladders oh, at all. Oh, Jesus, yeah. Yeah, it's like, I guess we're on the island forever. <laughs> you have to climb the radio tower. Well, somebody else is doing it. Fuck it. Uh, let's go live with the wolves. Maybe if we bring them a deer, they'll accept this is one of their own. <laughs> you should totally go watch some of those videos of crazy Russians climbing up the side of skyscrapers. <laughs> it's like, oh, holy crap. Before you broadcast the SOS. Hey, it's amazing that this thing works. We got everything crossed for you down here, LC. Yes. Thank you. Anyway, so we actually had to manually adjust the radio. It's pretty neat. I actually really like this because... Yeah, adjust that capacitor. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, the there we go. ball comes in. And I accidentally go to the right place almost immediately. Whoops. Usually it's a long, arduous process of trying to find the signal, but I, I accidentally found it immediately. We are stranded on an island in the Dragon's Triangle. We need help and medical supplies. Please respond. Also, there's like a million dudes trying to kill us, so maybe watch out for that. Also, fucking dire wolves. <laughs> yeah, we found dire wolves. <laughs> Bring a science team with you. Seriously, this wolf was like one and a half of me. I've killed eight of them. We could sure use a visual. <laughs> I'll figure something out. We'll be heading your way. Just set the entire island on fire. <laughs> oh, crap, you are my hero. No, she's gonna set the island on fire. That's what's gonna happen. Hey, you know, just cracked a smile. <laughs> right. Laura, how do you not have frostbite yet? A fire. 
She's accumulated a layer of protective dirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, of course. Anyway, that was one of my favorite set pieces in the game. <laughs>